this is so spectacular. It is a fulfillment of a, a dream of my whole adult life. And, and I'm just delighted for finally okay. pulling it off. And now I have to think about the other half of the climb, which is getting back down. So, time to go. Too Finish. much stress. This is Adele. Oh, hello, Adele. I'm to speak with you. It's been a great climb, really great climb. It should be a fun traverse over there, too. Bye. Okay, be careful for the right Bye. Will do. Love you. <laughs> when the climbers finally succeeded in getting to the summit, uh, it was pretty late in the afternoon and they came down to a place called the Monk's Hut which is on the back side of the Eiger. It's, it's very high but um, we were able to get up there with Adele and Sienna. Um, but when the, the climbers came down to that spot the sun had almost dipped below the horizon and so we only had about 10 minutes to actually get the shots and the Harlans were much more interested in actually greeting each other <laughs> and having this special emotional moment. So it was very much of a documentary scene shot under very low light conditions. It was uh, basically a, a cameraman's nightmare to get it. Yes, we are. We're at 150. Oh, perfect. They succeeded in, in capturing this very spontaneous moment. I think it's a wonderful film because it has to do with all the great values of family, um, dedication to sport, um, the natural beauty of the world, and trying to preserve all of it. It's a very interesting story, and why not share, share the story, share the celebration, and share, share the conclusion of this, this, this interesting chapter. And I think it's going to be something that's going to be really special when it all comes together. It just worked out perfectly. And to have finally fulfilled that dream was, well, a dream come true. <laughs> it really was just ideal.